Hey, this is Lewis from Breakdance, and in this video, I want to tell you about the superior Flexbox sections and columns functionality in Breakdance. So Elementor did finally get the memo on Flexbox, and they've added Flexbox as an experimental feature. Well, in Breakdance, Flexbox is just the way layout works by default. Sections, they're Flexbox. We have a div element, that's like Elementor's container element, it's Flexbox. Columns, we have a columns element, and each individual column is Flexbox. It's not an experiment, it's stable, this is the way Breakdance was designed to work. In Elementor, you have to enable the experiment. Now in Elementor, you can either use Flexbox, or you can use sections and columns, but not both. So in Breakdance, you get a section, it's Flexbox if you want, or you can stick columns in it. Here we go, let's do two columns, no need to use Flexbox at all. And then if you want Flexbox for something inside the columns, you can go over to Layout, and you can use Flexbox. Best of both worlds. You get, you get all of the options. In Elementor, okay, let's enable Flexbox and con Container Option, and save the changes, and now let's go into Pages, and let's just open up a page with Elementor, and everything is a container now, right? You can, you know, you can create a column structure out of your containers. These are containers. There's no longer, they're no longer columns. So you may notice when you resize them, they, they don't really see what's going on there. They're not taking up the full width the way they would if they were actually columns. Maybe Elementor will address this. Maybe this is just part of the fact that the feature is still experimental. But anyway, you get the idea. In Breakdance, your columns are going to take up the entire width. But you can use Flexbox at the same time. Okay, uh, let's, let's take a look at one of these individual containers. And here we have our Flexbox controls, just like Breakdance. Um, but let's say we were to disable Flexbox. So we'll just make this inactive. Okay, now let's, now let's go ahead and refresh this page. Now we can use proper columns. Now resize correctly, right? You got section, columns. You got all your, you know, section, column, layout options. But no more container element. No more Flexbox. You search for container, it's not there. In Breakdance, best of both worlds. You can add a section. You can add columns. And you can add, we call it a div, they call it a container. The proper name in HTML is div, that's why we call it that. You could add a div. You can do it all in Breakdance. It's not an experimental feature. It's Breakdance was designed from the ground up to work this way.